How's it going, Lin Fan fans? Welcome to another episode of Lin Subscription. Today we're checking out Detective Je Jeffy by the channel Super Bowser Logan. Let's get into the video. It's time for dinner. Yeah, Jeffy, it's time for dinner. Oh god, oh no, is it green beans? Is it green beans? Yep, <laughs> I knew it. Jeffy, why'd you shoot me in the face with a tennis ball blaster? Because I don't want to eat your crappy food! Then what do you want to eat, Jeffy? Uh, Happy meal! Okay, then let's go get you a stupid sandwich. Gooch. What the frick? You're not going to make him a sandwich? You're going to go somewhere to buy a sandwich? Weird. A foot long banger? What kind of sandwich you want, baby? Uh, can I get a foot long banger with cheese? Oh, freeze! Everyone on the ground! Oh, no. Ah, it's getting robbed. Put the money in the bag. <laughs> oh, but I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Hey, why did you check his gun? <laughs> Right. Who is that? All the money. Is that someone that lives Sorry in their house? The, the, the tennis ball in the face. Oh no, they're gonna oh think God, Jeffy, Mario did it now. Because he's has to. Jeffy, forget about your sandwich. We just saw someone rob a store. What do we do? Do we call the cops? We go back and get my sandwich. Jeffy, shut up about your stupid sandwich. <laughs> uh oh. Hold on, Jeffy, go. Here come the police. I reckon they found Mario's hat at the crime scene. I think Mario did it. Well, let me see who that is. Uh, hello? What, the cops! Thank God you're here! I was just about to call you! Why? To turn yourself in? What, turn myself in? No, what? Well, you're under arrest. Under arrest for what? For robbing a sandwich shop. Well, I, I didn't rob a sandwich shop! Oh yeah? Well, we found your hat at the scene of the crime. My hat? Oh, okay, well, I was at the sandwich shop, and it must have fallen off when I ran away. All they need to do is check their security cameras and they'll see that he's in the clear. Wait. Yeah, you were running away because you just robbed the sandwich shop. Well, no, no, I ran away because the robber came in and he robbed the sandwich shop. Okay, what the robber look like then? Well, he, had a, he had a ski mask on. But really? Like in a cartoon? Yeah. Oh, what, did he have like a big bag with a money sign on it too? Yeah, yeah, he did. Come on, what do you think, I was born yesterday? Because I wasn't. I'm 42. Okay, obviously Wait, you look like you were born yesterday. Don't they, don't robbers wear ski masks? Don't they do that? Or am I doing it wrong? <laughs> all right, officer. There's my son. Jeffrey's gonna, the gonna, wrong gonna, gonna do with it. I just opened up my piggy bank. Look at all this money. And there's the money you stole. No, that's it's like fifteen. It's like a millionaire. That's not the kind of money you keep in a piggy bank. What kind of choice was he doing that he has that kind of money? Well, I pretend to be a girl online and I sell pictures of my feet to weirdos. <laughs> That's like the ultimate catfish. Oh my god. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start doing that to get a bit of cash. Man, I wish I had feet. Wait, wait, is that a tennis ball blaster? Yeah. That's exactly what was used in the robbery. Oh, come on. Everybody has a tennis ball blaster. Well, I don't. We're just a square. <laughs> well, okay, what is it? Make fun of me, Day? Why do you hate me so much? God. <laughs> Probably because you come dressed up in a different costume every single time. You visit that house. Be because you're accusing me of a robbery that I didn't commit. Well, look what I have to work with. We found your hat at the scene of the crime. You have a whole bunch of money that's missing. And here's a tennis ball blaster that was used in the robbery. Okay, but that's just all a coincidence. Yeah, okay, whatever. How about we go back to the scene of the crime and see if that jogs your memory? Okay, fine. My son wants a sandwich anyway, so Jeffy, just stay here. All right, buddy. All right, here we are at the scene of the crime. Look familiar? Yeah. Oh, the foot long bang. Hold on, man. Just one minute. Of course it looks familiar. I was just here. Robbing the place? No, I was ordering a sandwich. Well, then where's the sandwich? Well, she never had time to make it because the robber yeah, came Yeah, exactly. It's the robbery. W which was you because you were the robber. Well, no, no. I was just ordering a sandwich. All right. I'm going to This, this is a good plot. I'm going to go this Of course you didn't recognize me. I was just here. Ma'am, have you ever seen this man before? Yeah. He was the last person I saw before I got knocked out by a tennis box. Oh, really? Yeah, because I was here ordering a sandwich. Now, ma'am, what was the last thing he said to you before he knocked you out with a tennis ball? He was trying to get the roast beef up between my legs. What? No, I wasn't. Oh, this doesn't look too good for you, buddy. Or just, just check the cameras. The cameras don't work. They're purely for decoration. Oh, why did they make the Yeah, he does work there. Okay, look, you're so he would know if the cameras work or not. ...that says you were here on the day of the robbery, and we found your hat at the scene of the crime. Or just, just check for fingerprints. You're wearing gloves. Oh, come on. You're coming with me. No, tell, tell the truth. All right, say bye to your son. All right, Jeffy, apparently I'm going to jail for armed robbery. How long are you going to be gone for, Danny? You're facing 35 for life. Life? No one, no one, you know, went to sleep forever. Well, that's the law. Apparently I'm going to jail for 35 years, probably. Well, what if I get hungry? There's Lunchables in the fridge. Wow, 35 years for a robbery that... Does that even have the right evidence? Everything's just purely coincidence. But what if I want wings? Just use your piggy bank money. 
How do, can I call my lawyer? You can meet him at the jail. Come on. <sighs> All right, Goodman. Tell it to me straight. Well, Mario, I reviewed your case. And? And you are so effed. What do you mean? The prosecution's gonna have a field day with you, Mario. They have so much evidence. What do they have? They have your hat at the scene of the crime. Yeah. And they have witness testimony from the employee saying that you were the last person she saw before she blacked out. Oh, look, I know it looks like I did it, but I didn't do but it. But didn't do it, Well, no. if it looks like poop and smells like poop, then what is it, Mario? It's... Mud. Poop. Ding, ding, ding. Poop. Your poop, Mario. Oh, yeah. I was just there buying a sandwich. Well, Mario, do you have an alibi? Where were you during the crime? I was at the restaurant. Shut up. Yeah, I he was you there. Shut that dirty little mouth. I never want to hear you say that again, Mario. But I was at the restaurant. Shut up. He's telling the you truth. You were on the beach in the Bahamas drinking fruity drinks from some dude named Pepito. No, no, I wasn't. That's a lie. I know, Mario, but if you want to win this, you have to lie. You have to lie, lie, lie. And once you're done lying, you have to lie some more, and then you're going to tell one more lie with a cherry on top. But, but I want to tell the truth. Since we're just lying, get you out of a crime you didn't even commit. I mean, I can see it working the other way around, but he didn't even do anything. Okay, if you want to tell the truth, Mario, then do you just want to take the max sentence? Life! Life, Mario! Or do you want to take the plea deal? Well, what's the plea deal? Fifteen years. Well, fifteen years? Yo, yeah, well, seven and a half with good behavior. I don't want the plea deal. I just want to tell the truth, and I want to be found innocent. Okay, it's prediction time, and my prediction is that Jeffy is going to become a detective, and then from that, they're going to find out that Mario is innocent. That's what's going to happen. I haven't seen this, I promise. It's just a guess. Let's keep watching the video. All right, Mario. Let me see what I can do. Okay, I don't. I don't want to take the plea deal. I got it, Mario. Just okay. Let me see what, what can, can you do. do. Come on. Nice flag. Shut up, Mario. Let me do all the talking. Okay. All rise for the Honorable Judge Strongbottom. Order, order. Ah, order sorry. Is now We're talking decision. to me. Mario, you are being shot. Why is the king, the the judge? That's Chef Peepee's dad. Charged with armed robbery. How do you bleed? Your Honor, we would like to take the plea deal. What? Perfect. Open and shut. Mario, you are hereby sentenced to 15 John years in federal okay. prison. Is nice. that like is that like Neville Longbottom, but instead he's Strongbottom? Interesting. Hey, interesting. I didn't want to take the plea deal. They had us in a quarter, Mario. I had no other option. All right, you're coming with me. You didn't even try. I don't want to go to jail for 15 years. Seven and a half with good behavior, so be good. Oh. Oh, oh, take that diaper. Ah, oh, oh, oh. he's... Look at that Why sad face. Why again? How am I gonna tell him? <laughs> sad <laughs> face. It looks pretty happy hey there, to me. Champ. There's uh, something I need to talk to you about. What's going on? Well, uh, it's about your daddy. He's uh, he's gonna be in jail for a long time. <laughs> Freaking rip! Pouring out for my daddy, my D A double D Y. Hope he doesn't drop that what? show. Why is he so happy about well, it? Since he's not gonna be I here, thought he loved uh, Mario. I'm gonna have to put you in a foster home. For imaginary friends. No, no, not like the TV show. This is a foster home for very real. Yeah, they've referenced this before, but I, I haven't actually seen the show. And children. Well, why can't I stay here? Well, you're just a kid. You can't live here by yourself. Doesn't so you Rosalind live there? Who my dad didn't do anything? He was there the whole time. Well, it's too late for that, kid. He's already in jail. Well, I'm going to get my dad out of jail. I'm going to prove he's innocent. Well, how are you going to do that, champ? You're going to get a spoon and dig a tunnel under the prison like in a movie or something? No, I'm Detective Jeffy. Yes, he is. I knew it. This is where this is going. Oh, okay. I got nothing better to do. Come on. All right, kid. Here we are back at the scene of the crime, but my men sweeped all over this place, so I don't know what you're hoping to find. There's no evidence here. Never question, Detective Jeffy. <laughs> Exactly, never question Detective Jeffrey. What's that boy? He found a clue? Why is it acting like a dog? Oh, I'm just gonna take a couple fives and a couple ones. Man, his methods are unusual, but he's the best detective we have. It <laughs> <laughs> must be the only detective you have. Yeah, what, how did we miss that? A one step closer to freeing my daddy. Now I gotta track it. Tastes like clown. <gasps> oh, it's that guy. What's his name? Um, yeah, 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 yeah. He's like a clown criminal guy. What's his name? Um, I forgot what his name is, but uh, uh, I can't remember. Call me. All right, kid. So why are you setting up a birthday party for yourself? Because we found clown hair at the scene of the crime. And if you set up a birthday party... He's like, is he 15, 16, not 6? Clowns will come because clowns always go to birthday parties. 
Well, why do we need a clown to come when you're already here? Oh, 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 oh sick oh, burn, oh, Brooklyn Tea Guy. So, you want me to go get my doctor outfit on so I can treat that burn? Woo! <laughs> yeah. right, seriously, right, that's though, a good what, what is the plan? Or we set up a birthday party and the clown will come. So we just gotta sit here and tell the clown to come. Oh, oh I think that's him. So convenient. Hello? Hey, kid. I heard there was a party, so I thought you needed a clown. So I came over and I brought my tennis ball blaster so I could do tricks. So, you gonna let me in? Yeah, sure. Come on in. All right. All right, here's the clown. Nice. Which one of you kids is the birthday boy? Uh, I guess that'd be him. Oh, I, I didn't mean to do that. I accidentally did that to some woman's face earlier. Oh, uh -huh. he just admitted to it. Sorry for making a mess. Why would you stand in front of a policeman, you idiot? You guys got any napkins? Oh, I'll just use my ski mask I used earlier. Mm. <sighs> mm. Ooh. So how are you guys going to pay me today? I only accept cash. Mm. Uh huh. That's the, well, the third thing. On the table? Must be falling out. Didn't know I was getting that old. <laughs> uh huh. Another clue. Can we hurry up and cut this cake? I'm starving. You really woke up an appetite after you robbed a sandwich. You must shop. be hungry for a rest. Yeah. Now, wait a minute. Did you rob a sandwich shop earlier? Uh, no. Okay, you were just saying a lot of weird stuff, but I'm sorry for accusing you. Where were you earlier today? I was robbing a sandwich shop. Oh, I knew it! <laughs> oh, that's it! You're under arrest! Let's go! Oh, He's gonna get arrested. Nice job, kid. You're a natural. Alright, Mario, you're free to go. Wait, what happened? Well, you should thank your son, Detective Jeffy. He's a real Sherlock Holmes. Jeffy, what'd you do? Daddy, I got that long song that Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. What? She sells seashells by the seashore, you know. But, but what happened? Daddy, how much wood could a wood chuck 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 which means it was you, because you're a clown. I wonder how many takes it took for them to get that up, get that all right. Oh, 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 I got him. Oh, oh, yeah, if you feel like a pimp, go and dust your shoulders off. Oh, oh, look what I'm doing. Oh, because I'm a pimp. Oh, eh? oh, I'm going to go get my doctor outfit. <laughs> okay, why did you ever change your clothes in their house? That's so weird. <laughs> all right, all right. So I can treat that burn. Oh, they're gone. Oh, they're going. Well, man, I... He just copied what I said. They put on the doctor outfit and everything. Cause, you know, it's funny because doctors treat burns. And... Well, I thought it was funny. It would have been so funny if you would have heard it. Oh, you're leaving already? Oh, yeah. See you later, man. Oh, see you later. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So I can treat that burn? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Linden Subscriptions. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did so, be sure to give it a like. Rush my choice and get next week's episode. Check out my last the code over there, Limpan's Reddit over there, or check out my last Linux subscriptions over there. And I'll see you guys very soon with another episode of Linux subscriptions.